Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and, uh, well, Patch Tuesday update for this September 2025. They fix for all sorts of different uh, products and services. It's not just Windows. Um, 81 security flaws, two are zero days. There are nine that are critical. So um, two zero days that are already exploited in the wild uh, in there. So that tells you why you need to update your system. Once again, today is Patch Tuesday. We have the updates coming through uh, in for Windows 10 22H2, for Windows 11 23H2, 24H2, 25H2. So if you're on the Windows Insider previews and got 25H2, you also get the security updates today. There's 41 elevation of privilege vulnerabilities. There's two security feature bypass, 22 remote code execution vulnerabilities, 16 information disclosure, three denial of service and one spoofing vulnerability. There are of course two publicly disclosed zero days already exploited in the wild. One is for the Windows SMB uh, elevation of privilege vulnerability. So this is the uh, SMB server uh, that might be susceptible to uh, relay attacks depending on the configuration. And the other one is a um, Microsoft SQL Server uh, vulnerability, um, volu Volncheck, um, which is a improper handling of exceptional conditions in a um, file. The um, main critical flaws, if we look at Windows, is uh, one is, so let's check it out here, graphics kernel, uh, remote code execution is critical. There's a Microsoft graphics component as critical. Uh, in Microsoft Office, there's a remote code execution that is a critical flaw. Also, there's a lot of important uh, fixes, including in the Windows Defender firewall service uh, elevation of privilege vulnerability, a lot of important flaws there that seem to be uh, fixed in the firewall, the Windows Defender firewall. Now, they're not critical, they're important. Important is a lower grade, but still, uh, it is important to fix them. The, another critical in Windows imaging component, there's a Windows NTLM elevation of privilege vulnerability. And uh, Windows Hyper-V remote code execution, Windows graphics component remote code execution. And um, there's the Xbox that has a certification bug, uh, critical flaw also. And there's a lot of other flaws that are to fix just in the TCP IP and so on. So this is an important month for Windows to make sure that you fix everything as there's a lot of flaws and especially when we do talk about um, vulnerabilities, the uh, remote code vulnerabilities. So uh, this is important to uh, check out. So update your systems and make sure that you uh, fix these flaws to stay safe. And uh, hopefully everything will go right. And of course, I know some of you are waiting because you just want to see how it goes before you actually do anything. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.